Hi guys! Um, so today I'm going to, to do a bit of a, a book haul. Um, being in isolation, I, well, I'm somewhat, I'm, I go to work still, but I did buy quite a few books online. Not a lot, a lot, but a fair bit. And then I had to go to the mall the other day just to get a present. Um, and I, I couldn't help it, so I ducked into Dimmix really quick and I grabbed a couple books, so. Let's get started. And sorry if I'm eating Tim Tams. I'm really hungry. They're really good. So we'll start with what I got online. So I got four books. I actually bought two copies of one. Because I'm an idiot. But I want to get chocolate on it. The first book I got online was Crescent City by Sarah J Mass. It's a new series, I believe. This is it. Um, it just looked really cool, um, and I'd, it'd be nice to have a new young adult series to read. Yeah, this one just sounded really cool. Just got this one. Um, I do think it's a really big release because when I went to Dimmicks, it was stands with heaps of these books, but it sounds really good. Um, I can't even explain it because I don't really know what happens because I haven't read it. But I'm gonna read this soon. It won't be the one I read next, but. It looks really good. I'm really excited to read it. The next book um, I got online was by Sarah Lou. I think that's how you pronounce it. L-U-Y. What? L-Y-U. Sorry. Is The Best Lies. So this one was $17. Um, I think it's kind of romancy, but someone dies and they have to figure out who killed their boyfriend or something. Um, and I think this book was maybe twenty five, thirty dollars. Can't remember. There's no price tag, but this one has a price. Um, and these are all from Dimmix. I love Dimmix. Then I got One of Us Is Lying by Karen McManus. This one. Um, I believe it is a store. Uh, store series um I, there's a couple more books i saw them in the store and my friend keeps telling me about them she loves them um so five students will detection only four leave alive so if someone dies someone gets murdered and they have to like, figure out who does it i'm pretty sure i'll be reading this next my friend recommended it to me and i promised her i'd read it next so just i'll be reading this one next I promise i just have to finish grey Vale first oh wait dracora first Um, and the book I bought two copies of, because I'm an idiot, is A Court of Thorns and Roses. This one just sounded cool, and I've seen it in one of my other friends Chelsea's bookshelves before, and I was like, that kind of looks cool. Um, but I'm very, I can be very picky, and I don't like taking chances on books, because if I don't like it, I don't like it, and I don't want to waste money. But I'm going to take a chance, I'm going to read it. Sounds really cool. This is another young adult fantasy, I believe. Um, but it does sound something like right up my alley. So, that one go. Okay, so those are all the ones I got online in my shop. Online shop, I had a discount code as well as I used Honey. And it discounted me heaps. I paid a lot less than I would have if I didn't use it. Okay, so the two books I got at Dimmix when I went in on Saturday. One I have, and you might think I'm crazy, but when I show you what it is, it'll all make sense. But the other book I got is by Alexandra Christo, Into the crook, Crooked crooked Place. This is it. Um, this one's $20. Just another young adult fantasy um, magic kind of thing. Um, it sounded cool, and I was like, why not? I'm really bad at explaining, aren't I? Okay. And the book that I got that I didn't need. Like my boyfriend said, do you need it? Yes, Alex, I need it. Um, so I have this book. I've read this book twice. I've talked about this book quite a lot. But there is a like special edition of the book. 
and I forgot it existed somewhat and then I went to the shop and I was looking at the books I saw it and I was like I need it right now I have to get it even though I don't need it but I had to get it and I don't even like hard copies but I like this one so I got the Akane special edition this is $30, but I had $9 credit to me, so I didn't pay $30. I swear. Okay. So this is the cover. So it's got the school crest for Akane, which is so nice. Look at it. And then the pages are gold. And there's the map in the first page. I can't remember if it's in colour in the book, the first book. I think it is. But it's just gorgeous. And I think, let me have a look. I didn't know it had that. And at the back, so I don't know, when Four Days Year was coming out, all these like pictures of the characters were being released. And they were in the back of the book. Oh, I guess he's not in this book. But yeah, this was such. Oh, I'm so glad I got it. It is so pretty. But now I have to rearrange my bookshelves because I've got them by also alphabetical last name. So now I'm gonna really have to shift everything a little bit. But I'm gonna have to do it with the new books anyway. Anyway, um, I know this was a bit of a boring video, but I really wanted to do this one. Um, thank you for watching. If you did, um, if you like this video. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, comment down below what you want to see next. Or if you want to read any of these books, or if you have, let me know. Um, uh, also, go and follow me on my Instagram, at Joey's Novels. Or I also have Joey underscore Kate with two E's. Or on TikTok, I have Joey Jojo Junior Shepardu on, on there. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Um, feel free to subscribe if you want to see more. But yeah, thanks. Bye.